Hello! Welcome back to more Stardew Valley. Definitely did not forget to click the record button. It always happens when I play Stardew Valley. This is the second time I've done this. Anyways, I literally just started over the day, so we didn't miss anything like last time, but we're gonna go through the comments first. The fish frenzy that happened last episode with like the carps and whatever, it's just a new 1.6 edition and I was right. You just catch a bunch of whatever fish is having the frenzy, whatever. Also, I was reminded to open the geodes, which I just didn't realize how many I had. We have like 40 of the regular ones and then just an insane amount in general. So that's gonna be planned for today. We're gonna go open some geodes with Clint. Um, I also want to run to Robbins and look at the barn and coop upgrades. Technically, we don't even need to waste the time doing that because I did that last time and now I remember. The coop is 10,000 gold, 400 wood, and 150 stone. So I decided I want to upgrade the coop because I want to get ducks because we need a duck egg for a bundle and then a duck feather for a bundle. And then after we get that upgrade, we're going to do the barn one, which is like 12,000 and however many wood and stone. Anyways, um, I also was told that opening the doors for my animals on the coop in the barn, it gives me more friendship with them. So we're gonna start doing that. I used to do it, not in this one, but just when I used to play. And then I stopped because I could have sworn that if you forget to close it, I thought that something could happen to your animals if you open it, like they can either get like taken or something can happen. But I'm assuming that's only if you forget at the end of the night before you go to sleep to close the doors again. So I think as long as I remember to do that, they should be fine. And then the last thing is that fire quartz is level 80 plus in the mines. And I'm also gonna find gold around then, which is what we need for our sprinklers. So plan for today, we're gonna water everything like usual, take care of all the farm stuff. And then we are gonna head on over to Clint's, open up all the geodes we have. And then anything we get, we're gonna bring to Gunther and then we're going to use the rest of the time to go in the mines and hopefully get to level 80 because I'm pretty sure we're at at least 70 anyways, so it shouldn't take too long. Okay, opening up at the barn. Let's see. Hey, um, I'm a little concerned about letting the chickens out because you can't see them very well in the grass, but I'm assuming they just know to go back in. Open up that one. Oh, they immediately came out. Hey. <laughs> okay, we have all of our farm stuff done. Grabbing the insane amount of geodes. I'm leaving the Omni geodes because pretty sure you need to save them for stuff in the desert. I could be wrong. I really haven't dealt with the desert much. We got our upgraded trash can as well. I don't remember what the point of that is, but you know. Okay. We're gonna start with the cool geodes, work our way to this insane amount of 44 of the regular ones. Okay, on to the 44 regular. I don't remember how many donations we have to make to the library to unlock the skeleton key to make it to Krobus. Whatever it is, this has got to be making a chunk towards it. Ah, we have like five rewards or something like that. Six. Look at that. Okay, we're going to sprint all this stuff back to the farm. And then we're gonna head to the mines. I don't know if I can sell the rest of these minerals. So you guys should let me know. For right now, I'll keep all the minerals and you guys can let me know if they're important or not. Okay, now off to the mines. Why is she walking so fast? What? I was like, does she usually walk that fast? What the heck happened? <laughs> okay, weird. Okay, we're at level 70. We can do it. We also still need to be on the lookout for the glow ring as a monster drop. I don't know which monster it drops from, but we're bound to get it eventually. Okay, halfway there, made it to level 75. Five more levels to go. Holy! Why is there so many skeletons? Okay. Okay, well, I don't think we're getting to level 80 today because it's already 11.30. We're gonna sprint back home because I don't want to die in the mines. 
I'm pretty sure once we get the fire quartz, we finish the blast bundle right before we get the mine carts unlocked. So that's going to help a lot. Oh, what is that? What the heck is happening? Mystery boxes can now be found. I'm sorry? <laughs> what are mystery boxes and where can I find them? Time to water our plants. Oh my gosh, I forgot to close their dang things yesterday. Are they still alive? I didn't get a notif- Okay, they're both there. Whoa. Jeez Louise, the one thing I said that I needed to do and I did not do it. I swear, if you guys tell me that something can't happen to them and I just got lucky that it didn't, I'm gonna be upset. <laughs> now, where are the chickens for me to say hi to? There's one. Couldn't tell you where the other one is. Okay. Back to the mines. I feel like this is one of those... Oh, there it is. Those, like, I spy books where they have the packed full of just random stuff and you have to find specific stuff. That's how it felt trying to find the chicken and all the grass. So, can these mystery boxes just be found, like, laying on the ground? Or do you actually have to do something to find them? <gasps> I got a diamond! Hold on, have I found a diamond yet? Oh my god, we don't have the crystal little, little, little thingy. You can put it in and it keeps making new ones. Okay. Well, this is fun. There's a ladder right there and we're on 79. So we've already made it to 80. Are we going to get lucky enough to find a fire quartz on the first level? Well, obviously not this level, but... Firewalker boots. Okay, three defense, three immunity. Ooh, put those on. Yay. Fire... <gasps> we got it. What is that? Holy blade, 20 to 27 damage, 4 speed, 2 defense. Plus 2 speed. Oh, hold on. I might. <gasps> it's so fast. Okay, we're using that one from now on. You guys can let me know if that's a bad choice or not. We already need to upgrade our axe again, or our pickaxe. Okay, next plan of attack is getting enough gold to upgrade our pickaxe. I'm out of energy. And we're going to leave now because I want to be able to put the fire quartz into the community center bundle. Okay. Yay. Oh, and I get more geodes. <laughs> is this the first big one we finished? Like, is this our first star? We are the Junimos, keepers of the forest. Whoa. Oh yeah, okay, hold on. I think this is our first store. Store? Star. It is! I feel like we have to watch him, it's the first one. Look at him go. Ah. Yay! That's exciting. Woohoo! And now he's gonna follow us around. That's so fun. Okay. Sorry, little dude. We're gonna go, though. I am gonna go smelt some gold. So we can hopefully go and upgrade our pickaxe. I might regret doing that, but I kind of just want to get it over with. I am still one gold bar away from being able to upgrade my pickaxe. Okay, well that means then that we need one more day of being in the mines trying to find some gold. Oh! <gasps> I forgot. It happened like two seconds ago, but I still managed to forget. Yay! I forgot to close the stupid doors again! <laughs> what is wrong with me? Okay. It might be kind of dumb, but what I'm gonna do... We did all of our little farm chores. I'm gonna run to Clint's and we're gonna upgrade our axe to the next level. We're gonna use our minecart for the first time. <gasps> Look at that. Okay. Boom. Now we're gonna use today once again. <laughs> I feel like it's all we've been doing recently is going to the mines, but oh, lost book. We're gonna go mining and 
basically what my plan while we upgrade the axe is just to keep pushing the mines for as much as we can even though it's kind of rough oh look at that there's all that gold and this way once the axe is done we will definitely now after this have enough to upgrade the pickaxe and then once we go to upgrade the pickaxe we're going to use our axe to go collect all the wood we'll need for upgrading the coop obviously this is not going to happen today in this episode that's just that's my plan and i'm hoping along the way we get lucky enough to find the glow ring these levels aren't bad like you can still see them it's just tedious because it's takes forever to break all the rocks oh we just got a mystery box the only thing i remember about the mystery boxes is i'm pretty sure you have to bring them to clint to open just like geo's strange bun what the heck is that dang we're getting so many diamonds ah my gosh that guy came sprinting at me stop jeez they do a lot of damage we made it to level 90. is this sword actually good negative one speed 30 to 45 damage though that's oh okay when it says negative one like i don't feel like that's that bad let's see if we can fight anything and give it a test now, how is there no monsters down here? Oh, I guess I should have kept my mouth shut. <laughs> okay. I feel like the damage is worth it because we're back to doing or getting bats in like two hits. Okay, this stupid thing is never ending, so we're getting out of here. <laughs> okay, I think that was very successful. We got all the way to level 90. We definitely have enough gold now to upgrade our pickaxe. Okay, we have 499 stone. So, we are pretty much golden when it comes to the coop. <gasps> slime egg. Oh, I don't know why I'm getting excited as if I have a slime egg. <laughs> Ooh, it's raining. So I don't even have to water my stuff. What is this note? My knee's acting up again, and you know what helps? Rubbing the darn thing with hot pepper. Trouble is, my supplies supply? My supplies run dry. If you've got one to spare, be much obliged. George, uh, well, actually, I'm assuming they'll grow one more time before it's over, right? Oh my god, I just needed a ding. Ah! I needed two more gold star melons, and I did not get them. And now they're not going to grow in time. Basically what this means, we're just gonna have to go ham with the pumpkins. They're one month, so does that mean I get milk from them yet? <gasps> we did! Wow! Okay, do we have- oh, we do have a cheese press unlocked. Okay, so one copper, ten hardwood, forty-five stone, and forty-five wood. The issue's gonna be the wood. I'll take it. We had exactly 45. Boom, cheese press. Heck yeah. And then I'm assuming cheese is in the- Yeah! Okay, this is great. We are getting places. Okay, I have an idea of what to do. So, for the fish tank bundle, we have three left. The night fishing one, river fish, and the specialty fish. We can catch the wood skip, I think, once we get our axe back, because then we can get into the secret woods. Sandfish, I don't think we can get until we get to the desert. That's fine, not worried about it. The river fish one, catfish we can't catch in summer, as far as Google told me yet. The shad we can catch today, because it's raining. So that it says nine between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m., or no, 9 a.m. and 2 a.m., season spring, summer, and fall, and the rain. So the tiger trout is in fall and winter in any weather. So we'll have to wait till fall to get that one. We'll have to wait for fall for the catfish and the tiger trout, but we can get the shad today. Okay, the walleye is obviously one of the night fish. So 12 p.m. to 2 a.m. in fall in the rain. And then the eel is in spring and fall in the rain. Okay, so yeah, both of these we'll have to wait till the fall. So basically the only one we can get today is a shad, but it's better than nothing. Oh, you know what I forgot. Okay, 
down here is gonna be my spot of choice. I forgot I made the duck of my bobber. <laughs> Look at that! We got it. Okay. We fished for literally the entire day, got the shad, as you guys saw. We're gonna run up, drop that off at the community center, and then I have almost all of the fish smoked already. There's like three or four left I have to do, so we'll do that real quick before I go to sleep. And then I think we're just gonna end it there. We should be pretty set to get, um, boom, there it is the coop next episode because i think i think it's gonna be tomorrow we'll get i think we'll get our axe back maybe that means next episode where as long as i remember hopefully i remember <laughs> we're gonna immediately go and upgrade our pickaxe then we're gonna use all the time to gather as much wood as we can and then probably just save up as much money as we can from fishing for any extra time we got what on earth just happened? What was that? Why did it just sound like my tree got knocked over? Okay, we're gonna keep the cheese because that... My god, never mind. I have eight pikes to... <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I don't know why it sounded like my tree got knocked over, but we... Hopefully you're gonna get the coop next episode. That's gonna be my main goal, but I just want to get as much money saved up because we still need to finish this one so we'll need 10,000 15,000 oh okay so we still need a decent chunk of money <laughs> we, we should be fine i think jeez we got four thousand dollars just from fishing okay moment of truth is our axe ready it is i was right perfect so yeah next episode we're gonna get our axe upgrade our pickaxe get as much wood as we can upgrade the coop if we can get the coop fairly early on oh my gosh i just realized i only needed 150 stone for the coop upgrade and i have like 500 now it's, okay we're gonna have to cut down a lot of trees but that's fine the valley just might be a little bare um anyways yeah pretty soon we're gonna be able to finish most of the fish bundles and yeah i think we're making a lot of progress so hopefully you enjoyed as usual if there's any tips or comments you want to do go ahead and leave them i love reading them it's been helping me a lot uh, but yeah, I'll see you all next week for more Stardew Valley. Bye!